Because why did my depth top almost fall for this USPS bra thing? Y'all need to go with y'all one of these. Get on y'all soon. Hey my loves, welcome and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who do not know me, I am Janae Jelene and we're just doing this thing called Life Together. So this vlog is essentially going to be a few days in my life as a junior in college. It feels so surreal that I'm already saying that I'm a junior in college. It's just such a bittersweet thing to say every single time. So you guys already saw a little montage of my morning routine and I'm also about to make breakfast but before I get into breakfast I just want to give you guys a little rundown of what exactly is happening today. So I have two events that I have to attend today. So the first event that I have to attend this morning is this panel discussion with other black orgs at the university of florida as y'all know i am a part of black students in business so maya and i will be going to that event to just talk and represent our org and the other event that i have to attend is at five o'clock and that is for the mfos peer mentors they're just doing a kickoff and telling us like our requirements and things we have to get done and that is another one of my involvements here on campus being a peer mentor for the mfos scholarship program which is a scholarship that i have if there's one thing i'm going to tell you about college is to be involved when i was in high school i was not the best one that came to my social life it was just school and work for me and it's pretty much the same thing here in college but I just decided that I wanted to get involved because y'all once these years are over you will never get them back that's first and foremost so enjoy it and do all that you can while you can and also not everything is about a GPA look at me who applied to UF as a bio pre-med student switched to psychology and now I'm a marketing major and I have an internship secured my god it's so amazing I would have never thought that this is the route that I was going to be on but as the word says we make our plans but the Lord determines our steps because y'all I could literally cry because I would have never thought that I would be in this position but when you get involved and when you start networking you start to realize the different opportunities that are out here and you just never know what doors God may open so get involved get connected with people and get out of your shell because that's the only way you'll make the most of your college experience my god is so amazing. can you get an amen for that my god is just so amazing anywho Maya wants to head out of here by 10 45 and it's currently 10 11 so I'm going to go make my breakfast so that we can make it out of here on time MFOS, I'm a peer mentor in that program as well. But just always know that like you are meant to be exactly where you are. You made it there for a reason. Everything happens for a reason. So I feel like that was a big challenge coming into um, BSU, just the positions that I've held. Um, but just have that courage and that strength within yourself and just trust exactly like where you are. And so you really just have to sit down with yourself and figure out what is it that you enjoy and what do you want to put out there. Like me being a marketing major, I would have never thought this is where I would be. Like I got my CNA license when I graduated. I felt like I would be like a doctor. Well, I knew I was going to be a doctor, but here I am now. And it's just like when you just take those steps and you like, you know, overcome that challenge and you just push yourself to do something different, that's where all the opportunities lie. Because opportunities don't come to you. You have to go and find them and create them. So. Well, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. <laughs> <laughs> guys, so we are back from that panel discussion, and I loved it. We had a good time sharing different black orgs on campus and just giving, you know, the freshmen a little bit of advice now that we're like in our sophomore, junior, and senior years. Right now, I'm just about to do some homework and make some phone calls. It's pushing one o'clock, so I'm gonna try to get as much done as I possibly can. I think I can get everything done that I need to get done 
but I'm going to get into that now because at 5 o'clock I have the event to go to for my peer mentor position. So I'll check back in around 5 o'clock when I'm heading over there. Hey y'all, so quick bit change. Not really, I just had to change my shirt. I was really going to update you guys in the room, but my math homework took a lot longer than I expected. So I didn't get a chance to update y'all, but now I'm headed to my next event, which is a peer mentor kickoff. And when I'm in there, I'm going to try to finish my homework for my next class, because I do not want to get homework when I get home. I really just want to eat, shower, and go to sleep, because I'm so tired. But yeah, I'm going to head to the event now, and I'll see you guys in there. I took a shower and all that good stuff and I have yet to eat my food y'all my food is literally still sitting right here in the bag luckily it's still warm and I just got my smoothie out of the freezer I don't know if it's just me but I literally have to take a shower and like feel relaxed before I can eat my food like I literally said this on my TikTok because the other day I had to finish cleaning my whole room because I bought chocolate smoothie while I was out running my errands when I came back I had to finish putting my room together and i just didn't eat my food until i was done with all that but it was cold at that time but luckily my food is still a little warm i really need to give tropical smoothie a break because i know them people are tired of seeing my face but that caribbean jerk chicken wrap is so good i kid y'all not i'm putting y'all on caribbean jerk chicken wrap with some baked lays on the side and then that mango monsoon this is a seasonal item but when i tell y'all the monsoon is so good again if you follow me on tiktok my past two spending days with me i mentioned this mango monsoon because when i tell y'all it is literally crack it's literally crack Y'all need to go get y'all one of these. But that's pretty much it for the day, y'all. I did a lot. I'm honestly tired. I'm about to take some melatonin because I have been having trouble sleeping lately. So that's what I'm about to do. I'm about to get into my devotional, y'all. If y'all not reading y'all word, what are y'all doing? Get into it. Get on y'all Zoom. Because as someone who's like starting to develop their relationship with Christ, reading your word is so, so, like so important. At first, I was just really reading like my verse of the day, but like as I started reading my word, I realized how important it is, not just for your walk with God, but that's literally how you fight anything that you're going through in life. Like literally, the word is your sword, literally, literally. And as the word says, his word is a lamp to our feet and a light into our path, y'all. Get on y'all Zoom, don't make me start preaching to y'all, okay? Okay. And I got one more thing to say. Miss Lisette Demond. Y'all don't understand. I almost got got today. I had to get a new card because why did my dumb self almost fall for this USPS fraud thing? But Miss Lisette Demond, count your days. Count your days. And then I go and respond to the text and say, Thank you. It has been completed. Have a wonderful day. Are you able to confirm it? If I could really explain the backstory, y'all, <laughs> y'all will understand it a lot better. Don't think I'm crazy. I had ordered something from someone and it was shipped through USPS and it was like a whole little thing where it was returned and all that other stuff and I had to order a redelivery. Y'all, I'm not explaining the whole 360 right now. But I almost got got. I almost got got. And as somebody from North Miami, I should be more on peaches. But, anyways, Miss Lissette. I'm gonna pray for you. I'm pray for you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take the holy route. Right idea. Wrong person. Well, almost wrong person, but y'all get what I'm saying. Anyways, y'all, let me stop talking before my food gets even more cold. That is pretty much it for tonight. I'm probably gonna eat, do my devotional, and watch some movies. And yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow. So it's currently the next day. It is Wednesday, September 6th, and it's currently 12.36 p.m. I don't know why I slept until 10.30 today. I was so tired. I went to sleep a little late. I know when I got off the camera, I said that I was going to um, finish eating, do my devotion, and go to sleep. But I forgot I had like an introductory slide to work on. It's currently pushing 12.40, and because I overslept, I did not cook. I just ate some cereal, and right now I'm about to just get straight to work. We have about four hours and some change to get some things done, so I want to start getting into that because I have my management work to do. I also want to create some content for TikTok. And there is something else that I have to do. I can't remember right now. It's on my to-do list somewhere. And so, yeah, I'm just going to get straight into my day and just get started with working because I slept for too long. So let's just get straight to work. that I 
last night when I got home I was so tired because my body has been trying to fight off this fever so honestly I came home I took a shower and I did my Devo and I put on a movie and I fell right to sleep so here I am it is the next day it's Thursday September 7th and it's actually currently 12 27 and right now I'm about to head to JC Penny because I stained my pillowcase and my sheet y'all so I'm just gonna go buy a whole new one I'm over it but I'm like I should have just read the instructions but luckily when I went to go look at it um it's cheaper than what I have bought it for so right now it's saying $50 when I have bought it I believe it was $75 I'm not sure but I'm about to go buy another one and I also have to go to Ulta to get my discoloration serum from Good Molecules and then I also have to run to Target to get my body washes and that is pretty much all that I have planned for today I know there's an event tomorrow called the Black Student Assembly that the Black Student Union hosts I have been debating on going because my past two years of being here I have not went but my friend texted me this morning she was like she want to go and so I was just like mm, I'll see how I'm feeling <laughs> and I'll decide whether or not I want to go tomorrow but I think it'll be a nice experience so I just might go and I also did not eat breakfast um I didn't wake up with too much of an appetite so I'm just gonna drink a naked that I have in my refrigerator and I hope that gives me a little bit of a boost so let me just grab my things so I can head out So it is currently the next day when I got back y'all I was so mad because my Wendy's was not good and I just said forget the whole world but I am back um I hope you guys enjoyed that little hygiene shopping with me yesterday because I did grab a few things but here I am today I know you guys are probably like you're all dressed up I am about to head out to the black student assembly the outfit is given because it's a semi-formal 70s theme kind of thing and I'm super excited because I look so good I'm not really a gold jewelry kind of girl but I had to put it on today I had to put it on today so I look so good and I'm super excited to just have a good time it's currently 556 my friend and I had agreed that we were going to head out at 540. So we're going to leave now and I'll see you guys when I get there. Wait, 
surf, 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 surf. Pop a perk, pop a smurf. Not a dirt, I can call up dirt. Crow heart shirts, millions off merch. Sipping, dripping, tipping, tripping. Women, hey, linen, hey, dealing, killing, spinning, willing, grilling, hey, feeling, pay, money, puddle, gotta. Cut a lot of water, water, dollars, quarters, wits, water, rich, water, your bitch, on a, on a, on a, come on, come on, on a, hey, I'm a, stun a, stun a, sun a, summer, been in, on a, cook a, hey, black on, hey, jump on, wait. So as you guys can see, I am back home and I had such a good time at the Black Student Assembly. It was my first time and I'm so glad that I decided to get up and go because it was a vibe. When I first walked in there, it was a little empty and I was like, wait, did I not get the memo? But trust me, that auditorium was filled by 7 o'clock. But y'all, I had a really good time. Please, when you go to college, go out there and get involved. If you don't get involved, your whole college experience will be a waste. So please get involved. Do what you can. You don't have to be involved in every organization. But just talk to people. Get to know people. Go to a few events. Get your feet wet, y'all. But I think that pretty much wraps up a week in my life as a junior in college. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it this far in the video, thank you so much. I love you so much. And that's all for today's video. Again, thank you guys so much for watching grace and favor to you all and